certainly feeling that heat here in central Alabama. I'm in the Weather Center with meteorologist Briley Brown. Briley, it is downright hot and kids <laughs> are going back to school and the farmers have to deal with it. It is yeah. oppressive heat. And we like to think we're accustomed to it and we are somewhat, but it is very hot outside. Mm -hmm. Dangerously hot, especially when you consider uh, how hot it can feel inside a vehicle over time and even kids getting back to school next week. Uh, thinking about buses, hopefully all of those, most of them have air conditioning. Looking through the first uh, week of August next week, we're going to continue to trend above average in temperature. We'll likely continue to see some of those heat advisories and maybe even some heat warnings, especially in the West. The highest recorded temperature in August is 105 in Birmingham. We're not looking at triple digit heat. The humidity kind of keeps the temperature in check, but the heat index is what we're worried about, and it's going to continue to feel more like 105 to 109 through this week and even into next. Look at this. Let me show you how rapidly the temperature can rise inside a vehicle when it's left unattended in the sunshine. 90 degrees in 10 minutes, 109, 95 in 10 minutes, close to 115 degrees. So we all know not to leave uh, pets in the car or anything like that. Even soda can explode uh, when you leave things like that in the car this time of year. So just something to keep in mind. Back to you. Yeah, you ever have that happen? You know, you leave a I left in the a car. can of hairspray in the car Ooh. and it exploded everywhere in the heat. Don't do it. Yeah, <laughs> it's just something that comes with Take this heat. All your stuff out of the car. Mm.